Hi, this is WA3TTS, and tonight we're fooling around with a uh, ESI Model 250 impedance bridge from the late 50s, maybe 58, 57, something like that. And I'm uh, attempting to measure a 1.5 millihenry uh, inductor I wound up on a BN73 uh, binocular core here. And I'm following the directions in this, and on number A, I'll read it here, but it says, uh, set internal power to off. Well, you have a choice of running 6 volts off or the AC generator, and you can't very well make an AC uh, resistance kind of measurement if you don't have a signal source. So we had the lid off of this thing and we're checking everything out to figure out why it wasn't working like it should and went through and cleaned some things and checked to make sure I had proper uh, oscillator output and all that stuff that's playing away over here on the oscilloscope and it works fine you know the caps are good in it but uh, the instructions are wrong they just drive you nuts I sit here and okay I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna try and make a measurement with a uh, oscillator off and it just doesn't work that way but uh, anyway figured out what the flaw in the program was and so when we twiddle around here we'll change uh, doesn't take much you go to one decade either side of uh, 1.5 and it it loses the center uh, here let's do that And it doesn't take a whole lot to drop out of that either. And we're showing a Q of about 90. And it's a notch below one there, and it's on the, the Q times 100 scale. Hard to see on that one point. But anyway, neat old instrument. Kind of nice to be able to measure Q on the inductors with a old boat anchor. Works great. 73 from WA3TTS.